And in case you're wondering, after the guy got sentenced to jail, what he got shot for is the week before, since that's something that you obviously missed everything else I said, but you're excited about that part. At least you're listening. I give you that, at least you're listening. He threw a guy out earlier who was beating up on his girlfriend in the club. Same old scenario. He broke it up, protected her, put the guy out. Guy sitting out there getting high, came in and shot and killed him. Guy bumped by us going in. He's standing in line. They done already brought him in. He done came in and then shot. So that'll clear that up. Yes, he in the penitentiary right now, but we still ain't got him. And with his kids still ain't got no dad. Now, as I close, because I keep picking this up right here, this dash, this right here, this is, this is a part of that dash right here, this diploma. This diploma that you're seeking, this stuff you're going through. Quit saying, you know, you ask some of y'all, why are your people at home sending you to school? To learn. Do you feel like some people in here to learn? And don't be fooled. This right here, this is how our job going to be. So don't think we put you at a disadvantage. I'm glad I got my boots on because this training right here. Because you're going to work some jobs like this. You're going to have some people that clown on the job, some people that don't want to do no work, and the boss like, hey, y'all need to get this done. I'm firing people. And you got to still do what we're doing at this age right now is I got to stay focused on my goal. See, I can't entertain no negativity. Because I got three little people looking at me like, you better bring that check home, daddy. I entertain that negative stuff. I know my daughter want that stuff for Christmas. She want leap pad too, and I better bring it to the house. Mm -hmm. So I ain't got time to get mad at one of y'all and be like, man, forget this, and I'm up out of here. So have you got to that point? Have you stepped out and said, I'm doing this? Man, find your why. Your why, why you doing this. Quit talking about you coming to school to learn. Because we ain't getting that part. I'm coming to school because I need a diploma. That's my first goal. What you going to do with that? I'm going to be a nurse. I'm going to be, I'm going to work for waste management and make some real money on the trash truck. I don't care what you say as long as it's something legal. Because if you don't have a plan, the street's going to make a plan for you. And they got them. They got plenty of plans for you. This is a college student. This is a guy with good grades. The street's got a plan. They got a plan all the time. This is another guy that graduated. This is my little brother. I'm going to talk about that next time. Because everybody ain't doing bad. But guess what? He almost started doing bad because guess who was out front? Me. Me. I was out front. And he was, y'all got little brothers and sisters, any of y'all? The whole time he was doing this. I'm going to do that right there. I'm going I'm to act. I'm, as a matter of fact, I'm going to try to top what he's doing. See, you don't understand. You might be the role model. You might be the role model. I ain't gonna say you might be. You are. If it's somebody younger than you, are they watching you? <laughs> Please believe. They watching you. They watching you, for sure. So, going forward as I close, this dash right here, I ain't up here talking about when you die. Quit thinking about when you die. Think about why you live. Think about what you're doing while you live. Quit thinking this is tough. This ain't nothing. You can do this if you want to do it. Quit being so disrespectful all the time to everybody who's trying to say something to you. Now, we say it again. We've been where you are. Now, quit talking about stuff so hard. Quit making so many excuses. There are multimillionaires that say all the time, you cannot make excuses and money at the same time. Come on in now. You cannot make excuses and money at the same time. It ain't going to happen. It ain't going to happen. For you athletes, you can't not practice and talk about being successful. And there's a guy that talks about something that said, when you want to be successful, as bad as you want to breathe, then you'll be successful. Anybody got asthma? Anybody have a problem breathing sometimes? Or at one point in your life, and you try to, try to, try to catch my breath like that? For that next breath, that feeling, because your mind started going, oh, 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 what's, what's going on, what's going on? When you're at that point, when you want to be successful that bad, then that's when you're going to be successful. When you want this diploma that bad, that's when you're going to get it. When you like, I, I, that last breath right there, 
That's when you're going to get it. And until then, we just fake it. We just playing around. I thank you for the time. This ain't about me. This about you. Some of y'all like, man, they get tough on us up in here. Yep, yeah, because the honeymoon is over. We's married now. We's married now. We in here. We going to be here. We's married now. We going to be here. All the soldiers that lined up, they here in the building. You in the building. Let's make it happen. It's up to you. You got free choice. Do something with your dash. Stop walking around making it seem like I'm just going through the motion. Is anybody going to talk great about what that is? Is anybody going to be talking about, well, it was born and it ain't died. No, they should be talking about that dash in the middle. Man, I remember when, man, I was down and out. He came through and came through and helped my family out. I remember when she took care of my kids when I couldn't take care of my kids. Them are the conversations people are supposed to have. Ain't nobody supposed to be down about what you've done. And as young as you are, I know y'all always talking about being grown so you can have this grown folks conversation. So if we're grown, let's act like we're grown. And if your why or why you're doing this don't make you cry, that ain't your why. Get a new why. I'm trying to graduate so I can get some new J's. They promised me some new J's. That ain't your why. Because that ain't going to make nobody cry. You better get up on something that's going to help you for life. I appreciate the time. I can't wait to see y'all next time. I'm going to cover, I'm gonna cover financial stuff next time. I joined church on that. I appreciate you, bro. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I joined church on that. I appreciate you.